Welcome students. In this video, we will be discussing the important questions of Unit 2. Unit 2 consists of web form fundamentals and form controls. Before I start with the important questions, I will be just discussing the practicals which you need to see before you have started preparing for the Unit 2. In our practical series, you can find the videos of practical number 3, ABC and practical number 4. So if you watch the videos of practical number 3 ABC and practical number 4 ABC, it is as good as you had understood the basics of unit 2. Now let's move ahead with all the important questions which are related with the AWP unit 2. Some questions are important where I will be specifying the questions which are not important. You can read it once, don't skip any of the questions. But prepare well for all the important questions. The important questions are, List and explain different files and folders ASP.NET web application. According to me, this is not that important question. Okay, three layer architecture of ASP.NET, it is an important question. Explain ASP.NET life cycle page or a page life cycle is extremely important question. When you're writing the answer, please follow the pattern. First the introduction, then the main content, then the conclusion. And remember that wherever it is possible, you can draw the figures like this. Moving ahead, differentiate between the inline code, code behind code. I don't think so. That is a, a extremely important question. HTML control, web server control is about you. You can just read it once. Shorten on the page class. Please focus on this question properly. And please understand about the page class. So these are the list of methods or list of properties shown by you. So do we require to write all the properties? You can write four to five properties that is more than sufficient for you. You can write at the end, it is many others. Explain the use of global.aspx and web.config files. Please prepare for this question properly. This is a quite important question. Then the second stand start with the text boxes and web form controls. When you are asked for writing the paper, writing the answer for this text box control or any such kind of control, please remember that first you will write about the control, then you will write a tag of that control, then you will be writing uh, or drawing the figure of that control, then you can write some two to three or maybe four important properties of the control. If possible, write a small code for the control and then go for writing the explanation of the code and then you can go for writing the conclusion. So this is the way by which the answer need to be framed. Buttons, link button, image buttons. Okay, read it once. Uh, radio button checkbox, read it once. You should give a importance towards the question which are related with list box. Prepare for any of the one list box. You will be able to write the answer for all list boxes. The list are comprised of what your list box, drop down list, radio button list, checkbox list and bulleted list. So when you're preparing for the list box, two or three questions you prepare, the rest of the answer you'll find it is the same thing, only the tags are getting changed and the behavior of the list box get changed. But important properties are one and the same in many of the list box controls. So prepare well for the list box control because there are a lot of questions which can be asked on the list box control. A table control, read it one, this is the question which is explain about a table control, read it once. I will not be giving that importance to the question. Multi-view and view control is an important question. Please follow this question properly. Moving ahead, AD rotator is an important question. So please follow this question properly. The calendar control is an important question. Please follow the question properly. Moving ahead, explain five common properties of web server control. Uh, fine, read it once, that is more than sufficient. Uh, auto post back at runnet properties, read it once, that is more than sufficient. Uh, URL in code, URL decode, okay, you read it once, it's not that important. Whereas user control is the important question, the question can be asked on a user control, validation control, the question will be definitely asked on the validation control, you know that validation controls are required field, regular expression, uh, range validator, custom validator, compare validator, all the videos are being present. So you please watch the practical number 3 ABC and 4 ABC that will be useful for you to revise this unit 2 also with the help of practicals and once you have seen a demo how the things work it will be quite easy for you to write also and all the important questions I'm telling you you please follow those important questions also moving ahead after the validation then you will find the controls uh, which are like a tree view and the menus the menu control fine read it once menu and tree is one and the same 
but i will be more focusing more than tree view and menu i will be more focusing on the question of site map path so these are the important questions which are related with your unit 2 and practicals which are important for your unit 2 so all the practical videos are there important questions are been taught to you uh, so please prepare well for the exams all the best for exam please like the video share the video and subscribe the channel